This is lesson 8 of 20 lessons on how to build a Joomla website. This lesson demonstrates the third method of creating a database at a web host. You should only be watching this if the only method you have of controlling your hosting account is via a command line interface. Here's what you do to create a database. Start by choosing a database name, a username and a user password. For the purposes of this lesson, I'll use as the database name Video Demo, the username Australia, and the user password Sydney2000. Now log into your command line using the details provided by your host. Type MySQL and enter. You'll now see the MySQL prompt. Start by creating a database. You type create space database space and then the name of the database. Video demo followed by a semicolon and enter. Then create a user and assign them with privileges. Grant space all space on space then the name of the database you just created in this example video demo dot asterisk space to space, then the username that you would like to create, and I'm going to use Australia, at, open inverted commas, a percent sign, closed inverted commas, space. Now the password, identified, space, by, space, open inverted commas, and the password you'd like to use. In this example, I decided it would be Sydney2000, then close the inverted commas, and finish with a semicolon, enter. And what that command has just done is grant all privileges on the video demo database to a user called Australia at any host identified by the Sydney2000 password. That's it. Your database is set up, the database user has been created, and now you're ready to move to the next video where I'll show you the rest of the Joomla setup.